So I was asked how to get this effect using a font other than Varsity. So that's how I'm going to show you, or that's what I'm going to show you how to do. All right, so I'm going to just come to my text. I'm going to just type the word text. And the font that I have chosen is Acknowledgement Regular, and that's a DeFont font, okay? And then I'm going to go ahead and enlarge this and zoom way in so I can see it, okay? Now I'm going to come up to, with this selected, come up to Effects Shadow Layer. And I'm going to change this to a different color, nice and bright, so I can see it. And then I think I'm going to choose uh, 0.075 and hit Enter, and then choose OK. And then over in my Layers panel, I can see that I now have a shadow layer added. Okay. So then with that new shadow layer, I'm going to, with it selected, I'm going to come to Effects and do Shadow Layer again. I'm going to change this one to pink. If you haven't noticed, I like nice bright colors so I can see. <laughs> and then I'm going to do 0 0.075 again. And not 37, 75. Okay, there we go. And then I can select one shadow layer, hold shift, select the other shadow layer, and go to path, back minus front. And that gives me that space in between the text and the offset. So I can select both of these and I can change the color to, let's say, black. And you can better see what's happening here. Let me turn all of the strokes off and that's how you do it. So you can do that with any font you want, all right?